early, and then the defense got to his turnovers and got control of the game. But our defense all day. I mean, what, seven turnovers or something like that, and six <coughs> interceptions, and you know, short fields. I think they scored two times or three times. We had two interceptions and a fumble recovery. Is that what? Yeah. 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 And then they set up at the, at the two, and then we had the kick return. I mean, but they were just outstanding. I mean. Playing the run, playing the pass, they, they were absolutely amazing. Offense, we converted, did the things they had to do. But I thought offensively, really, on the day, did not play as well. I thought I missed a lot of opportunity, a lot of little things, and uh, need to clean up a lot of stuff. But the special teams was really good. Uh, again, proud of them. You know, it's, it's, you know, we won 59-3 here. This has always been a tough place for us to play. And uh, just proud of the way the guys come out and did a great job. Questions? Nate Andrews stepping in for Terrence Brooks. I mean, the guy just makes – he makes plays he's a football player. I mean, game makes sense to him. He sees things. He does things. Very unselfish player. Does whatever you ask him to do. Can play dime, can play safety. I mean, just did a tremendous job. What a player. And there are guys that just have a knack for being around a ball and making plays. He and Jalen Ramsey. I mean, yeah. you take about it. You had two freshman safeties out there. You had two true freshman safeties. And all that. I mean, they both scored touchdowns. And I mean, they can play the ball. They can tackle. They can run. They can play multiple positions. I mean, they're very good football players. Did you, did you anticipate him playing right away? Did Who's you, that? When you signed Nate? No, well, you never knew. Nate was a guy that, you know, you, you don't know. But, I mean, his, every time he's around something, he does well. You know what I mean? And the more he was in our camp, we said, you know something, this guy in time, he'll have a chance to help us during the season. I mean, he just kind of – the game makes sense. He picked it up, processed his information very well, made good decisions, and, you know, he's physical too. It looks like he and Ramsey and then actually really the whole defensive backfield, they're starting to pick up on, on the pattern reading principles you guys have put in and all yeah, pattern match stuff, which is very hard. I mean, it's, it's hard stuff to learn now. you gotta, you got to understand it and do it, and, and it takes time and as, as it goes. And when it's done right, it can, it can make you miserable. So, well, they obviously know what happened Thursday night. They, they, they know where your standing is going to be now. How, um, how does that, coming into this game, the mindset, it, it just – I hope nothing. It didn't, it didn't I hope matter. nothing. Okay. I, hope, I hope it doesn't matter, and it shouldn't matter. Where we're at should not matter. How we play and how we prepare is what should matter. And if they ever believe in our system, if they ever believe in eliminating the clutter, if they believe in what we're teaching, now's the time. Because success to me reveals what you really are. Success, where you're at, what you're doing, if you can keep the selfishness out of it, and then the ability to focus and play one at a time. And that's the key. And, that, and that's what we have to do. Does this, this team just seems to have a knack for it's like a, a snowball going downhill. I mean, when you they feed off each other. Yeah. They really do feed offense, defense, special teams. They again, they care for each other and they like each other. And I think they 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 generally just they have fun playing football. So it's not a coincidence the offense scores, then you get a pick six. No, it no. doesn't. I mean, they, they they just man, they just feed and, and they understand how each other they're they're not independent of each other. That's why you hear me. That's why we don't ride on the bus. Offense, defense. That's why we don't do anything in our organization is never offense, defense. Never, ever, 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 ever. And I'll never do it because you can't be an offense and a defense. You've got to be a team. Until you understand the momentum of a team and how it ties together, that's the only way you'll ever be successful. Yeah, well, we hear the guys all the time say, we play one game at a time. And, I mean, that, that's what we pound in their head. I mean, and I hope they continue to believe that. And that, that's important. I think they will. I'm not saying they won't. But no, success, to me, success reveals what you are a lot more than failure. You know what I'm saying? And, and I think these guys have it. I really do. I think they have that focus. I think they understand that. And hopefully they'll continue to do it. You mentioned the offense. Was part of that never being able to get out there and get Well, it is. It is. It is. It is. And then I think we had some times we we got to be a little smarter. Now get great. Play the game. As soon as you start to press this game and think, and think you're going to do that, it bites you. Whatever's there, read it, take it, play with it. That's it. What about Janice? What did you, what did you say? I thought he was solid. Did some really nice things, did some good things, but did some things I didn't like. I thought at times made some decisions and got a little greedy at times. And I think he needs to understand that. You got to play the game. The game's bigger than me as a coach, it's bigger than him as a player. Been th there's been a bunch of Jameses before, there'll be a bunch of them after, there'll be a bunch of whoever's. You got to understand how to play the game one play at a time and take what it gives you. How good was Austin stepping in for Brian at center? Seemed to be very good. I mean, Nikita made a couple plays, but for the most part, seemed very good. Seemed very good. I guarantee it's hard to tell that TC the line, but their guys weren't disruptive, making a lot of plays. Yeah, I, I, what happened on the interception where you know, the rollout there? Should have ran the ball. Yeah. He just runs it for a first down. That's what I'm talking about. Greedy. I, 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 I mean, why, why make that play? It's fourth and two. The first option on Nick is run the football. That's what he should have done. Is that just, a, again, it's like. That ain't nothing that you do what your coach to right. do and do it. Right. 
you think the greediness came from the fact that again, I don't, no, I don't know what it is. I don't care what it is. <laughs> Run the ball, right, and get the first down. That's what your coach to do. Have you? You've been on a lot of teams, man. This defense is playing at about a level. It's getting there. I mean, this is what you envisioned mm -hmm. when you hired Pruitt. When you brought in this system, you, you mm -hmm. thought something this could happen. Mm -hmm. I thought we could be a very good defense. Thought we had a lot of intangibles and a lot of components. I think the true freshmen playing makes it easier for them because they never they didn't know another system. Or? Nah, I don't really think that. I just think that those guys are exceptional guys to be able to learn and process what's going on. You, you touched on it again. I just want to ask about special teams. They were really good. I mean, coverage, yardage, field position, our coverage teams, you know, pinning them down in there. And Kermit, boy, you see what Kermit's capable of now. I mean, you really see. I mean, that guy got a chance to be a special guy. He really does. He really does. Was Kenny okay after? Like yeah, he was fine. He was fine. He was fine. It was kind of a scary moment. It really was a scary moment. Then they said he was okay. I mean, it, it, the way it looked. Glad they had that pet. I don't know why. I can just push stuff back. <laughs> fine. I, I mean, he's got these. I'm already he's up there on the sideline jumping up and down the whole game. I think so. I, I don't know. I have to wait and see. I, I, not that I know of off the top of my head. I have one question totally off the – why was uh, you know, just something like Dumar? He's a captain. Yeah, he's a senior, he's, and he's, he's a snapper, and he's done a great job. Yeah. And uh, he earned the right to be out there and do it. Phil, Phil's, Phil's done a great job filling in and being our long snapper and hadn't had one bad one all year. And he's been a leader and done a great job. He really has. Did you even address the team about Oregon? Did you all mention that? Yeah, there? I did. After that, I said – Forget it. It don't mean anything. It has nothing to do with what you do. I said, you're going to hear it. I know everybody's tweeting you and calling you and you got mess. Family, friends, that, forget it. Forget it. None of that means anything. Continue to play well and prepare to play well. That's all that matters. And then you put your head down and you wake up. Then if you're there, you're there. But you can't, you can't worry about the shoulda, coulda, wouldas and what I got. Forget all that stuff. When you think about the last three games y'all played coming in here with those crazy atmospheres and the Bobby mm -hmm. Bowden and Club Center in Miami, compared to this atmosphere, which wasn't anything like those, to still win by 56 points and get up, I mean, well, that's We challenged them. I addressed them in the beginning. I mean, to me, it revealed, to me, I told them today, to, to today's a revelation of, of uh, are you truly believing in the system. To me, it reveals who you are today, not the other three games. You can get up to play those, you know, and, and or, after coming off emotional wins, not there's anything wrong with well, I don't mean that. But you come off three emotional wins. Can you come here and continue to play at the level you play at? And uh, we, we answered that question again. Can we do it again next week? And can we do it the next week? And can we do it the next week? That's the, that's the challenge. If you want it, that's why it's a, it, it's a marathon. It eliminates. And the weak-minded and the people who stray and, and get out of focus, that's, that's the key. It's a grind. So they went with a lot of max cover looks again. It's very similar to what Miami did. I don't know that they blitz more now. Times, but they did. They did at times, but a few. Yeah. But we, we were sharp in that. We just had the short fields. You know what I mean? It was just that was just hard. We never had a chance Five to. Two, yeah. I mean, defense was playing so well. I mean, it's just. But I mean, we didn't have any bad reads or bad. You know, maybe a high throw or two. But you know, just the other. The other like I say, the naked. I wish he'd have ran. And got the first down. Just a weird game. It was. It was. It was a hard game offensively to get into. But, you know, that's just the way it goes. It was a different game. Yeah, it was, it was weird. Like, uh, I, I mean, it's almost like 